But I know when I do. Oh, I need some sunglasses. Where are my sunglasses? I see you, sis. Doing your thing. Frontal hella late. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all being safe during this quarantine lockdown. So yeah, so I'm wearing no makeup, I'm wearing pajamas, just so you guys can see how it is out here. And also because I'm gonna put some clothes on for you. So this video is about it's a little AliExpress haul basically, just items that I found on AliExpress and hidden fashion as well. Um so it's accessories mainly and then a few clothing items for plus size, for some plus size scales, plus size cheekers. Um, so I'm going to show you the accessories first and I'll show you the clothing last. So I think I'll start off with Hidden Fashion. So I got this on Hidden Fashion. It's so cute. It's this cute bag. I've taken a picture with it recently. Oh, that's something bit me. No, with it recently. It's got a clasp like this. Yeah, and clasp it. Sorry about my nails. And it's like this cute little floral design inside. Hi, Nanas. You okay? This cute floral design inside, and it's woven. So I love it. And you can shorten the handle, make the handles longer. I shortened it because I don't really like it long, especially with what I was wearing that day. I didn't like it long. But yeah. And then the second item from hidden fashion is this cute bag i think you guys all know what i feel like it looks like some fendi hi nana you want me to come get you i'll be back this bag Whew. what can i say this bag oh sorry yeah so obviously i felt like it looked like fendi um i haven't used it yet so yeah let me open this up got a zip inside like a pocket zip and then it's got compartments inside feels a bit like weird material but yeah these items were quite cheap that's why I've added it into this Aliexpress haul because you know Aliexpress is quite cheap and hidden fashion is quite cheap like I think the bag was like £4 or £5 each so that's really cheap so on to Aliexpress stuff I thought this was cute <coughs> And especially to go along with this bag. <laughs> so yeah, this Fendi. Zoop. I thought this headbag would look so cute. Jokes. I thought this headbag would... Oh my gosh. Right, so. I thought this headband would look really cute together with the bag. Even though, you know, they're a bit... The headband is thicker and looks more like an F. And this is like that. But I just think this is really cute. And I thought, oh, I need to get this ASAP. And especially with this hairstyle, I thought this is a must. So I had to show you guys before I even took a picture because I was like, you guys are going to love this headband. But yeah, so. And I thought, oh, I'm going to leave it on. But I can't. Anyway, so next is this, this chain. It came in a red box, like a red velvet, a red box, and then it's like um, with silk inside. Personally, don't like it, don't need it because I don't like using a lot of storage. So I, I have something else to put them in. And it's just this tennis bracelet, tennis bracelet necklace, tennis necklace, I guess you call it. It's quite thick, this is, thicker than some people's. And um, with the letter P. And it's a clasp. So obviously, you can. What's up, Nana? Obviously, you can. I've got a feeling this girl's gonna have fallen asleep doing that. Right, obviously, you can um, clasp it on like this. Right, it's not going on. Hold on. Oh. Right, there you go. Or, is this the right way around? Or you can remove the pee, like if you want. So this can be like daytime and then nighttime, remove the letter. Or I mean, if you don't mind, you can wear it however you want, really. But so I've taken off the pee now. 
also means you can use it for other things. I'm not going to clasp it again. But yeah. It's very cute. Very cute. If I clasp it, if I hold it where it clasps, it's there. Okay, Lena, let me get you. The item. The next item is this cute. This tennis bracelet. Ah, this is much thinner. <laughs> this girl. All right, that's enough. This is much thinner than the necklace. It's it's a better quality than the necklace, and it came quicker. To be honest, the necklace came quite quick, but this came quicker. All right, the necklace I think took the same amount it takes a DHL hair. So what about a week? Or Nearly two weeks, I think two weeks actually. And this, oh my gosh, I love this bracelet, guys. And look at my wrists, and it fits me. So, if you've got a thick wrist like me, this is for you. Oh, I also got this. Okay, I'm really being attacked right now. Are you gonna attack me? Can I put you down? No. <laughs> I know. Okay. This has the letter L. It's a bracelet. It has a letter L on it. Um, for Lerato's name. For your name, Mummy. Mummy puts it on her wrist like this. It fits chubby people's wrists. Where was I? I was saying that this fits my wrist easily. You can obviously expand these, make them smaller if you like, and clasp it in if I like. Don't I do it too much because I feel like I probably will snap if I do it too much. I've done that before with another item. Right, now that I don't have Lenato in my arms, I'm going to show you how this looks on my wrist. So this isn't a clasp. Um, oh, I guess it is. Just a bit different. Put it in. It's the ones that you push over like that, like a watch. Yeah. And there you go. Glistening, glistening. But yeah, it's glistening. <laughs> this is super cute, guys, honestly. You have to get this. Like, you have to get this. And the fact they came with this, this is a very nice little little jewelry bag right so i also got this which is another l so my necklace p and like my bangles l and this is a foot an anklet i haven't opened it yet or worn it yet um i got another one i used to have another one that had the year of her birth 2019 but um it broke but i could wear that like i wore it for two weeks non-stop like even in the shower and it didn't even rust it just snapped because you know um so i thought oh let me try another one so i'm so sorry about my nails guys mm. but yeah so i thought this is cute and the l's bigger so it's more noticeable let me open it up you found your blankie do you want to go to bed then So the last thing I have to show you is this, it's a headscarf that's meant to obviously represent Gucci, duped Gucci. I mean, I don't even know how to wear this yet. But I know when I do, Ooh. I need some clown glasses. Where are my sunglasses? Hold on. Oh my gosh, I nearly forgot the other thing. Dupes I found it and I'm so sorry, Riri. But I had to find some dupes for your glasses. I hope this look goes. I don't know because I can't see because I haven't got my glasses on. You guys let me know. Is she giving? I don't know, but this has got definitely is. So that's on period. Okay. 
Okay, now that's also getting big mad right now. So I'm gonna do the clothes portion of this. This is the dress I got on AliExpress. I don't know, I hope you guys can see it properly. It's very cute, it feels lovely. Uh, if you've been on my Instagram, you've seen that I wore this already with a nice pair of wedges. Um, yeah, so this is not itchy material or anything. It's a bit stretchy. Um, I can breastfeed in this easily. Okay, I don't know why I'm doing that, but I can breastfeed this in this easily. This can come off if you don't like it. If you do, you know, it's a done deal, whatever. So yeah, I really like this and I love the bottom of it. Just in case you guys can't see, I have to show you guys. The bottom is so lovely. Um, I would say it's really nice. I got the largest size. So if you wear size 16 dress, UK, you can fit this easily. I would say an 18 size UK 18 dress could also fit this because of the stretchiness. Because I mean, it's crochet. So yeah. And I chose a size extra large. I'll write down my sizes down below of what I chose for everything. So yeah, this dress is cute. Pants. <laughs> I have a vision for them. You guys might not see it yet. I wouldn't pair with this top, although it doesn't look bad with this top. But yeah, um, I love these. There was an option of these or like a straight leg pants, so not wide leg. But I knew there was no way I was going to fit into them. So I got these instead. The material is a lovely material. It's got elastic here. So that feels good. And obviously it's a zip up. Um, it's not cheap material like. It's actually proper material. Just to let you guys know. Obviously it kind of cups the food part a lot. So that's something to think about. If you guys know me, I don't care. So I'm a rocket anyway. Um, because I got a food pan. No, everyone knows I got a food pan. But this is very cute. This is very cute. This is very, it's very cute. Let me get the next piece on. Oh, I got the la the biggest size for this one as well. I'll show you it. There's a three piece first, I guess. I thought this would be very quarantine, cute, friendly, you know, for a lot of us out there. Um, if you're short like me, 4 foot 11, this literally drags. <laughs> so that's that to think about. But, oh wow, this is very baggy here. The top is a great size. I'll probably just, oh, I can breastfeed like that. But I will say it's a bit odd here, so the fit is not that, I don't know. The duster, the duster is very nice. It's a great length, it's shorter than the trousers. I will say that it's kind of itchy. This material is very itchy. And I would have wanted it a bit like this. Just a little bit of skin here. A little bit of skin. Maybe could wear it with my headband, my Fendi's, you know. But yeah, I'll say this is cute. It, it just the cuts could be better, so I'm kind of not with these cuts. Like AliExpress is very hit and miss, guys. Just so you know, but it is what it is, right? Let me take this off. Let me just see how this looks like this. That's what it is. <laughs> I don't know what to say to you guys. This is like hmm. I'll show you guys how it is in a second. So basically I had to do this because this does not fit me at all. Like 
now I can't even undo this. Oh, by the way, these are itchy as hell. But I was trying to do, you know, Mad Lavam too. Trying to do, you know. But it doesn't close on my chest. It closes at the bottom. So I thought the best thing would be to tie it up because... And, like, have it as a crop little cute. And I think it works a bit, but it's just not as nice as if it was closed up. No. You'd want it for, like, official meetings. 14 and a below i'd recommend that top if not you have to see what i did it looks cute as a crop top so i mean whatever the last item i got is this bonnet i think it's cute so yeah and it's got satin inside which is nice you guys have seen me wear this ready so yeah aliexpress is very hard to jeez Aliexpress is very hard to shop for with when it comes to clothing, guys. Um, it's hit and miss. You've got to be willing to lose out on some money. Uh, I've had to do that before. Or you've got to try and think of, okay, another way you can wear this. Sometimes things might not be as good, as well fitted as like that, the three-piece set. Whereas the green dress fits really well. So you've got to just kind of like explore and maybe if you see something that fits really well from one store go to that store again and try again when you're plus side it's so hard because like it says china sizes and like the xxxxx somehow is always out of stock um i reckon they probably don't even stock up and they just lie to get us to go on their store um so yeah i say with clothes it's a bit hard but you manage basically you manage so I hope you guys enjoyed my Aliexpress haul and I can't wait to see you guys in my next hauls. Um, I was going to say to you guys, I want you guys to comment down below. With the lookbooks, right, you know how now I review them on here. Does that count as a haul? Do you prefer hauls or do you prefer lookbooks? Like, this is a haul haul because I didn't even put anything together. Whereas a look, the lookbook stuff is like from different shops and I just review them for you. But I called it a haul of my last video because I didn't know what to call it. So yeah. Let me know because it's spring and I've got a few items coming. So let me know. Let me know. But anyway, thank you for watching my video and I hope I'll get to see you guys in the next one. Bye.